I want you all to be alert. I am concerned about matters in St. Nicholas School. Academically? I was not inviting a guessing game, Sister Raymond. What's this, Mr. Conroy? I don't know, Sister. They're all uniformly terrified of you. That's how it works. Boy! Come up here. The dragon is hungry. So, one, two, three. It's a new time, sister. The church needs to change. The point being? We should be friendlier. Father Flynn, he called Donald Miller to the rectory. We are going to have to stop him, ourselves. What happened in the rectory? Happened? Hmm. Nothing happened. I had a talk with a boy. What about? Private matter. He's 12 years old. What could be private? You have the slightest proof of anything. But I have my certainty. I can fight you. You will lose. Why well, you gotta know something like that for sure when you don't? You come to your school, kids don't like them. <laughs> One man is good to him, this priest. It is unsettling to look at people with suspicion. I feel less close to God. When you take a step to address wrongdoing, you are taking a step away from God. But in his service? You are single-handedly holding this parish back. What are you doing in this school? There are people who go after your humanity to tell you that the light in your heart is a weakness. Don't believe it. You just don't like him. You are letting that convince you of something terrible. Look at that. You blew out my light. What did you hear? What did you see that convinced you so thoroughly? I don't think Father Flynn did anything wrong. You just want things to be resolved so you can have simplicity back. Doubt can be a bond as powerful as certainty. I'll throw your son out of this school. You hurt my son to get your way. You have no right to act on your own. You have no right. I will do what needs to be done. You should understand that, or you will mistake me. So this isn't typically the type of subject matter that would get me racing into the theater. You know, we have, you know, sexual abuse, the church, perhaps some racism. But, I mean, talk about powerhouse performances just in this trailer alone. I mean, if they could give an Academy Award for acting in a trailer, I mean, I would give it to Meryl Streep. And Philip Seymour Hoffman is not far behind, and Amy Adams is solid as always. Yeah, I mean, the controversialness of this trailer and of the movie, wow, a lot for one movie. I, but, and the fact that, you know, Meryl Streep, this, the casting kind of was surprising, but I think just absolutely perfect. I don't know that I would have, you know, after reading the script, thought of Meryl Streep or thought of Philip Seymour Hoffman, but wow, I think they just really did an amazing job. And, you know, it's an adaptation of a play by John Patrick Shanley, so I think that that's going to be kind of cool. I haven't seen it. I haven't heard anything about it but set in 1964 in New York City. So I think other, yeah. you know, it's kind of got all the elements. She's so stubborn and hard-headed that on her convictions alone, that she's ready, you know, to convict this guy. And he just, there, since there's no evidence, it just seems like, wow, you know, it's just like a head-on-head -head battle. That's really, really gonna be interesting to see play out in a full feature film. In the beginning, you know, you almost wanted to hate her because they, they painted her as this, you know, horrible woman and, and Philip Seymour Hoffman says, oh, the dragon's, you know, hungry. Mm -hmm. And then to see, you know, the, the fight and the battle that she goes, you know, goes after for this child. Yeah. You know, it, it was just, it was, it was amazing. You know, that she does it, yeah, she, they paint her as this Cruella de Vil, like, to the max. And then, you know, but she really does have this child's best interest in heart. And so it shows, what, you know, just so many sides to this, you know, it really looks great. I, you know, I don't know if I would take a date to this, you know, unless like I had a girlfriend I wanted to break up with and like we wanted to be depressed forever. 
but you know, I would really go see this film. You know, I would maybe family or friends. I, this really looks like a good film. Yeah, and and my hats off to them for making it because definitely a controversial subject, mm -hmm. a lot of controversy packed into one film. Some great casting. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if this one, you know, gets nominations for Academy Award. So yeah, are you giving a little Oscar buzz? I'm giving it a little Oscar buzz on this one. That's I don't good. think, you know, with a topic like this and, and actors like that, I, I, don't, I think it's silly to assume any, any other. Yeah, I mean, we, we are the ones. I mean, we we are forecasting. So Oscar buzz, Oscar you heard it here buzz. first. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, trailer hit for me. All right, so two trailer hits. This has been TrailerHits.com, and we'll see you next time.